So guys, there is this app that I've been using. Before I start this video, I literally need to show you guys like how easy it is for me to online shop and I have some of my pieces that I bought on this app. I didn't know about this, so when I found out, I was like, this is so amazing. It's literally like a Tinder dating app, but for clothes. So if you don't like it, you can swipe. You can swipe left and right just like you would with Tinder. Another thing that you can do is if you go to filters, you can pick whether you want it for women or men. Um, obviously, I am a woman, so I go on the women's section. And then, say for example, I want to get myself a bag or purse. You pick what colour you want. I've gone to all. You can pick whether you want it to be resold or from the original shop. This is really cool, by the way. Okay, so basically it shows you the price at the bottom you can see here it says £13 and it's from New Look. Obviously if you go to resellers you get it also for cheaper prices. Oh, I like this. So this is really cool. Oh my god, I absolutely love this. I'm like swiping left, right, left, right. But you get the gist. So I'm going to go back to filters. I'm going to go on all, then I'm going to go on resellers. So this is £58 from ASOS, £10. £10. I'm going to go back on filters and this time, hmm, what do I want? I'm going to pick, I actually want some shoes. So I'm going to go on shoes and trainers and then I'm going to go to original shops and all colours. Okay, I'm not feeling that. <laughs> oh, this is kind of cute. This is kind of cute. I'm going to swipe up because I like it. And if you don't like it, you swipe down. So I don't like that. I like that. Don't like it. Don't like it. I kind of like this. So it's literally, literally like a flipping dating app. And then when you go to home, this is literally everything that I've pressed like on. This is what I've pressed like on. And once you click on the item that you wanted, it takes you directly to the website and you can purchase it. So you don't need to spend hours and hours and hours on different clothing stores. This is literally all clothing stores in one app. And it's as easy as a Tinder dating app. So I'm going to put the link down below for this app. This app is actually called Milkshake. Um, it's available, I believe, on all iPhones. Um, I don't have a Samsung, so I'm not too sure. But I will put down on. I should put. I will put down in the description box when I do find out everything that I've disliked is literally over here. But yeah, guys, this video is sponsored by Milkshake. Milkshake, thank you very much for sponsoring this video. And like I said, some of the pieces that I've picked out were on this app. Let's just get right to the video, guys. Hope you guys enjoy. Hi, guys. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, then welcome. Before you continue, then subscribe down below before you continue this video because you're not allowed to watch it if you're not subscribed. I'll give you two seconds to do that. If you are subscribed to my channel and you're not new here, then welcome back to another lit video. Thank you for joining me again. I said that all in one breath. Anyways, today I am somewhere different in the house. I feel like a weirdo being like, put the to deliver in more, but okay. I'm doing something so different today. I don't actually know how to do these. I don't, to be honest, I don't even like watching them on other people's channels. I don't know why, I just find them boring. But I done a voting poll like a week ago and you guys chose this, so. You gonna give the people what they want? Also, I don't know if you know this about me. I mean, you don't, but I am the biggest PLT fan that there is. Like 99.9% .9 of my wardrobe is from Pretty Little Thing. I do need to start switching up, but I done like a shop and it was pretty much from Pretty Little Thing and then like a couple stuff from Misguided, like this gown. But mainly it was PLT and then Got myself a cheeky pair of trainers from JD Sports, whatever. That's irrelevant. The majority of it is pretty little things. So I thought this is a perfect time because there's actually some stuff that I haven't tried. Well, pretty much everything that I haven't tried on yet. Probably tried on like one or two stuff. But most of the stuff I haven't tried it on yet. I literally just unpackaged everything today. So I was like, today's the perfect day for me to film this. They're still tagged. They're still brand new. And I haven't seen what I look like with them on. So I'm gonna see my reaction for the first time on this video with you guys. There's a mirror right there. So let's begin. Just gonna be random pieces that I like. I'm not gonna go in and be like this fabric, this material. Actually, I don't know, maybe I will, we'll see. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video and before you continue watching, don't forget to leave a big thumbs up. Thank you very much, guys. Okay guys, so the first piece is this 
oh god i'm so bad at this i was about to call it a zebra print yep i'm done out here this is a oh my god this is a snake skin bandu top like a black and white snake skin bandu top i got this in a size eight it's got one strap as you can see that's the reason why i bought it to be honest with you i feel like if it had two straps or if it had no straps then i probably wouldn't have got it i like the one strap look i think i've got another top like this in black actually but um yeah this is what it looks like super cash but you can definitely definitely dress this up i feel like the next thing i'm gonna try on is this i guess mini jacket from misguided although when i bought this online i really thought it was gonna be like denim material but it's like jogging bottom material I'll show you guys real quick it's got like a little collar on it so this is what the jacket looks like on i'm just gonna call it a jacket because i feel like that was the intention of this i mean it was in the coats and jacket jacket section i think i really like the fact that it's got a collar this gives me kind of like military vibes i don't know if it's just me the collars look like this they're quite sturdy compared to the rest of the fabric on the back This is what it looks like, the pockets. They actually are real pockets. They're quite big actually. I feel like, can I fit my phone? No, not my phone. The next thing I'm gonna be showing you guys is this oversized checkered shirt. I feel like this was like trendy back in the day, like when I was in secondary school, but I feel like they're, I don't know, they're kind of cute. I'm starting to like them again, so I'm just gonna try them on. Yeah, I actually really like this. And um, this is actually the first time that I'm trying this on. To be honest, everything is actually the first time that I'm trying this on. This is really cute. I definitely would never close it. I think I'd always just kind of like leave it open and I pair them with high-waisted mom jeans. Guys, next what I have on is this, I guess I would call it slinky because of the way it feels. This slinky black bodysuit. I like the fact that it's like kind of turtleneck, but not really turtlenecks. I don't have a neck, so I look weird when I wear it, so thank you very much. I love the way that it like feels on your body. It really like hugs onto your skin, the fabric. I don't know if you, you probably can't tell from the camera, but it's like really, really soft cotton. I really like this. I got this in a size eight from PRT. So far, I would say this is my favorite thing. Um, what I have on now is just literally a plain black bando top. Is it bando or is it bandu? Let me know in the comments down below because I think I call it a bandu top. But this is literally just like a plain black bandu top. As you do, size eight, it's quite, um, the material is not thin basically, it's quite thick cotton. I love that because it really like hugs your skin. It's not kind of like loose and just like sitting on you. It's like, it's grabbing you. It's grabbing you. If you want to get grabbed, then get this bandy top. Why am I acting like I'm promoting please? I need to chill. But yeah, I really like this. And I'd probably just once again pair it with heels and mom jeans. Guys, I also got this long line blaze on PLT and I've got it in a size eight i got this blazer to wear it quite casual so i'm able to dress up or dress it down so i'm just going to throw it on with this bandu top and see what it looks like so this is the long line blazer um the only downside that i would have i guess it's my fault from when i ordered it i would have seen it is that there's no like button to close it it's like you have to leave it open apart from that i like i like it because it's a long blazer i don't know if you guys can see but it's <sighs> Don't know if you see <laughs> but um yeah it's quite tight on the arms and i think it's because of the fact that this is a size eight so i would actually suggest probably getting a size 10 unless you're like super petite because the arms are quite tight fitted it's a stretchy material also yeah i quite like this i'd either wear it as a suit or just with trousers or jeans don't think it goes with this bandu top though i'm not gonna lie to you i would think more of like a lace bandu top like a lace bar Next, I have these plain airs black track suits. What drew me to these were the, okay, I was about to say three, but one, two, three, four, five. Buttons on the front, I felt like it was different. Um, it wasn't your usual track suit, but it has just like the elastic band or the drawstring. So that's why I got them. But I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm not really feeling the bottom of these because they are like this. So I myself have had to fold them. Yeah, they're literally just plain. I really like them. Um, they're literally just for stay at home, I guess. Shop run? I don't know. School run? Who knows? So guys, what I have on next could potentially ruin my rib cage from sucking in too hard. These are just plain black trousers that I bought when I got the blazer also. I felt like 
I could wear the blazer with jeans, but I could also pair it with this. I don't know what vibes I'm going for here. Take me to court vibes. Give me this job vibes. I don't know. I really like it, apart from the fact that I can't breathe. Apart from that, I love it. The pockets are not real, by the way. There's actually no pockets for these trousers. Um, so I also have these shorts. These are not from Pretty Little Thing. These are actually from Miss Guy. Oh, well. These are from Pretty Little Thing. I absolutely cannot breathe in these. These are ridiculous, guys. Look at me. I mean, I actually got these in a size six. I don't know what I was thinking. I don't know who I was kidding. I tried it on and was just like, what the hell? Probably because I got them in a size six. I just <laughs> don't like them. It is the warmest, furriest, most amazing coat I've ever come across. This is also from PLT. I would leave the links down below, but guys, I actually cannot be bothered. I honestly went out last night in this to go for a Sainsbury's run and it was so freezing cold. And I kid you not, by the time I got to Sainsbury's, I was boiling hot in this and literally had to take it off to do my shopping. It keeps you super warm. The inside is like half fur, half fur and then half, I don't know. This is not, this is obviously faux fur, not real. But um, yeah, I got this in a size eight because I didn't want it to be so big to the point where it looks like I have a blanket over. Guys, the very last thing that I have is this black hoodie. Now, the reason why I got this is actually because of the back. I found it super funny. It says, still his hoodie season, ladies. I don't know what season it is. I got this because I actually steal my man's hoodie. I absolutely love it. I think it's like meant to be Halloween vibes, but I will be wearing this year round. Thank you very much. So guys, thank you so much for watching. I don't know how I managed to look ugly just from trying on clothes. I was gonna try on some more for you, but I honestly am so sick of trying on clothes. If you guys saw the struggle behind the scenes, I wish you could see it, but you know, obviously not gonna be in it naked in front of you guys. <laughs> bit too personal anyways that it was my very first one but if you do enjoy this kind of stuff then comment down below and let me know that you would like to see more hauls and i will go through sufferance for you guys i'm getting strangled yeah i'm super tired now i'm actually gonna go what am i gonna do i'm basically already in sweats i've actually paired up the still his hoodie season with the tracksuit <laughs> but yeah thank you guys so much for watching if you stayed here till the end i will see you guys on my next video I've got to stop doing this. Bye, guys.